Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to NBA 2K23. Today, we are back with Invincible Cards. And, well, are they even worth it at this point? Well, we're going to talk about that today. Is one of these cards here, one of the other, that I did, wasn't, like, super excited for just because at, at this stage of the game, Invincible Cards are not all what they're cracked out to be. So, let's talk about it. We got 99 overall, small forward, power forward, Jason Tatum. This to print Celtics jerseys. I don't know why I even said that. 6'8", 99, 99. First of all, 6'8". I thought he was 6'9". Yikes. 55 Hoffers. Again, it's not what he has. It's what he doesn't have. So, assume he's got everything. What doesn't he have, though? Is there anything we could add here? Um, Maybe Pro Touch? I don't know. Vice Grip would be a good one. And Brick Wall. Those would be nice to have. Not necessary, but, you know, they'd be nice to have. At this stage of the game, Standing Dunk is a 95. Unbelievable. That's... Yeah, other than that, everything else in strength to 98. You can really just add a shoe to make them look better. All comes down to the animations with these cards at this stage of the game. Let's take a look at them in the freestyle. All right, taking a look at our boy Tatum in the freestyle. Uh, like I said, you know, at this stage of the game, 6'8", I would have really liked to seen him get a small forward shooting guard capability. He's always had a pretty nice jump shot, but at this stage of the game, He's just another archetype, pretty much, of Larry Bird, but smaller. Would have loved to seen him put him at the two. He does, it does feel like he moves very fast. Oh, wow, he just kind of burst right into that dunk out of nowhere. But, yeah, I mean, I like Jason Tatum cards, but at this stage of the game, no one's running a 6-8 anything below the shooting guard. At least, not that you should be. But, you know, he's got 99 everything. He's got the badges. He's going to be a valuable card, but... Is he a card worth spending at this stage of the game? Or could you go get yourself a budget option of Karolinko and some of the other cracked out cards they've given us recently and save your money? I don't know. Is this Invincible even worth anything at this stage of the game? There's only one way to find out. Let's get some gameplay. Wait, hold on. What was this behind the back? I can't remember. Hold on. Real quick, before we get the gameplay, what's this behind... This is behind the back, not between the legs. Damn it. Hold on, folks. Let's jump the gun here on the between. Okay, I guess it's all right. All right, now let's get some gameplay. All right, here we go. We've got a young Jason Tatum. <laughs> He's going to be a cone. we got to see if we can get him more involved. All right, let's go. Get out over there, see if I can get some right there. Immediately coming all the way in. Looking out to a young uh, freaking Yao Ming. We'll take a free bucket. All right, let's go, let's go. Bring it all the way in, coming all the way around, stupid Kevin Garnett. That's end game Durant, baby. Ass taco doing, huh? My God. All right, see if I can hit him on the trail, cheese here. I'm gonna hit him right there. Three, bang, on the trail. Down, let's see what the dribbles are. Um, get Tatum to help me out here. I can, ooh, got him running in. Oh, oh, I didn't know that was Kevin Garnett. That might've been a bad roll. God, dude, I love that his taco fall is just bullying mine like mine's not a taco fall himself. Um, coming all the way around there. Look at that, Jokic, baby. Got six seconds. I gotta throw it in somewhere. Uh-oh, Tatum, good shot. Oh, that was so close. All right, let's go. Can't play much better than this, too, by the way. You just can't. Um, coming up that way. Caught him for three. Bang! Good shot, Durant. No. Get a rebound, dude. Good snatch right there. Let's give that to Tatum. Even though Jokic got the block, he needs the points. That way, I'm coming all the way in. Um. Come here, Tatum. Oh, no! God damn it. I didn't mean to do that. I love that. Yep, easy buckets. Oh, and he missed it. Oh, dude, can someone get a goddamn rebound? Like, for crying out loud, how many freaking offensive rebounds is that already? Five? Guy wouldn't even be in the goddamn game if it wasn't for his offensive rebounds. It's disgusting. Bring it all the way in. Offense rebound that. Oh, I'm here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Getting a little chucky here. Oh, there's the stupid shit. Dude, I hate this game. Especially that you can do that. Start of the second quarter, we kind of lost our way there in, at the end. We need to stay focused. Stick to the game plan. 
No more turnovers. When we get rebounds, he now has seven offensive rebounds, so that's nice. Um, I'm coming all the way down with Yao Ming. Ugh. Give me a good screen. Tatum coming in. Good foul. All right, good read. Dude, this game is ass. I'm trying to figure out how many offensive rebounds he can get. This game's ass. The dude's got nine offensive rebounds. I'm not getting any. And all my guys have 99 rebounding besides one. Get in there, freaking Sean Livingston. Get out. Get that crap out. Wow, we got a rebound. Holy crap. The Algo's starting to swing. We got a rebound, folks. Tatum. Oh, my God. Give me Butler. Get it. Yeah, you can suck it, too. Um, Up there. Over there. Taco. Nope, no fouls. Not in this game. Not in this fucking game. Good rebound. Good defense. You love to see it. Throw it up to Sean Livingston. Sean Livingston. Back out to Tatum. Tatum. Um... That way. Three. Bang. Let's get it. Give me that rebound. Oh, he's out. Okay. It's over. Go home. You guys know I'd never cut you short. We're going to end it nice and brief. Quick little gameplay today. Finish it off with some clutch time. Call it a game. Some other stuff he's got to do. Uh-huh. Yeah, George Mikan. Absolutely. Oh, still playing the defense. That a boy Tatum. I love that. Uh, oh, here we go. Wide open spaces. Play a little point guard. I got it. Oh, out of bounds, bitch. All right. Throw it up to Tatum. Tatum, stop. Okay. Well, didn't want to stop like that right now. Um, if I can get Durant to come around there for three. Bang. Again. Three. Oh my god, I didn't think he'd make that. Ah! Kevin DeRozan, three, two, one. Oh, good work, Kevin. I always shoot behind the backboard. Yeah, you freaking idiot. Uh-oh. The behind. Oh, off the dribble. Bang! Oh, good shot. What's that? Got him jumping. Hey, we'll take the jump. Get what are you doing with the scoop a loop? Throw it up to Tater. Tater, out to Jokic, little point guard action. This game's over. All the way in? Oh, God, clobbered. Blue Stars, hasta la vista. I'm Tom Bordeaux for Motel 6, and we'll heave the bright on farm you. Close enough. Hey, guys, looking for cheap and safe MT? Go and check out u7buy.com. A6K is rebranded with u7buy.com. They're safe, reliable, and... You can now get these cards as fast as humanly possible. Make sure you visit my link in the description below. And if you don't use the link, I don't get the credit. So make sure you click the link, u7buy.com. Go get the cards you really want. All right, guys, that is going to be the gameplay with Jason Tatum. Short and sweet and for good reason. I honestly don't know why anybody would use this card. Like, honestly. I, 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 to me, this card should be a buy now. It should be. 6'8", small forward, doesn't really do anything particularly well, has an okay jump shot, like a, it's a good jump shot, but it's not glitchy or anything. At this stage of the game, I don't know, I would rather use Mike Karolinko and Bob Nedelecki not having all the stats in the badge over this card. I just would. It's just, it's too little too late for a 6'8", small forward in this game. I mean, the only reason I could see somebody using this card is if, you were a major Jason Tatum fan. And even then, I don't know, like, you just there's a reason you don't see Jason Tatum out on the court, you know? There's a reason you don't. I've never ran into one personally, and I play Unlimited all the time, and I'm pretty sure I'm the only one out here using this card as of right now. And granted, it doesn't feel like a lot of, either SBMM just stays true to its word, or not a lot of people are, it's taking me so long to find Unlimited games right now. I don't know if that's just, like I said, SBMM waiting for someone to be of equal skill gap to match me, or it's just nobody's playing. Let me know in the comments below what the hell's happening there, because it's literally taking me sometimes as long as like 5-10 minutes to find a game. But I, guys, this 
to me, this is right there. It's just, it. if they're going to do Invincible current stars, we need to get, like, Jason Tatum's not going to get in endgame. So you need to give him a glitchy release, like a T-Mac release or a Kevin Durant endgame release. Like, there is no point for this card, like, other than a theme team at this stage of the game. But that's what it is. Uh, I don't know how he's selling for 200k. If you're buying this card, tell me what you're doing with it. Because sure as hell not playing it in Unlimited. Why would you? I mean, Karolinko is like 20k. And it is a way better card in my opinion. Or as, I mean, statistically and badge wise, no. But performance wise, you're going to get 10 times more performance out of the Karolinko with his better jump shot than this Jason Tatum in my opinion. But that's my opinion. Let me know in the comments below if I'm out of my mind or if I'm correct on this one. I, they should have put him at shooting guard. Like, if that was the only way he could even be slightly serviceable, in my opinion. But, I am just an opinion. If you still want to try him out, go for it. Let me know how he does for you. Hopefully, he does a lot better than I think he should. Other than that, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Richie Nation, party on.